The add-on traffic has just gotten a new update and it came with a lot of new features as well as some newly added assets. Before talking about this update, let us first introduce this add-on to the people who don't know what it is yet and let's see what you can do with it. The add-on is basically a car library that will allow you to save a lot of time on creating cars that is if you want to do it from scratch because it is often a hard and a time consuming task. The add-on contains a lot of realistic, optimized assets of various vehicles such as cars and also traffic related assets for architectural visualization, in addition to environment design, rendering assets or other scenes. It currently contains 42 different car models ranging from luxury to supercars to classic and contemporary. In addition to cars, it also has 9 bicycles and motorcycles. This in addition to 15 different utility vehicles and public transportation vehicles. In addition to 250 different traffic signs and street items. And also 4 different watercraft and 6 aircraft vehicles. What's great about this add-on is that it allows you to manipulate these assets with all the extra features it has. So you can animate the cars with the pre-made rigs where you can bake the wheel animation, animate along a curve, and customize the rig. It also allows you to change the lights of the vehicles, set them to park, low and high beam, or you can just turn them off. Additionally, all the vehicles have very detailed interiors, which is just great. And also all the assets have high quality materials that you can change and manipulate according to your needs with different settings. For example, you can change the main color and also the amount of flakes and the value of the clear coat. And the add-on allows you to apply changes to manipulate the assets at once by making multiple selections. You can also add dirt, scratches and bumps to traffic assets with just few clicks. Furthermore, the traffic add-on allows you to easily spawn assets where each asset has a rendered preview. By default, the assets are linked, but you can also add them as editable objects or convert them later. As for this update and the new features, the traffic add-on has now 14 newly added cars and vehicles that you can enjoy using in your projects. There is also a brand new paint material that offers more flexibility regarding coating, metallic flakes and more. Moreover, a new operator to change speed has been added and the UV maps are now fixed, which is great. The update also featured some minor changes to the UI which has gotten better and also some bugs and issues that the add-on was suffering from are now fixed, such as the bug with follow path in Blender 3.4 as well as the off-center wheels of the BMW and Audi. To sum it up, the traffic add-on is extremely useful and will save you a lot of time and effort, especially if you are working on a lot of projects or if you just want to see results faster. If you are interested, you will find the necessary links in the description. I hope you guys found this video useful, if you did, please give it a thumbs up, also please subscribe to this channel to stay updated with 3D software and the CG industry in general, thank you guys very much for watching again and I will see you in the next one.